Expecting snowy terrain and mountainous snowy mountains, which is quite unexpected. We were expecting more kind of desert landscape, I don't know why. That's what's quite a lot of really Makes expecting. me pleased that we've got off wheel drive actually. Um, yeah, look at it! Wow! Are we in Nevada yet? Did we cross over to Nevada? Uh, I'm not sure. at the Sands Hotel Casino. So you can see behind us, there's some pretty bright lights of the city. It's kind of like a little Las Vegas. There's the Sands behind us. It's pretty cool. So we just checked in, we just spent the night here, had a little gamble, and we're gonna have a fairly early night. So we've got to be on the road tomorrow for a big day of driving up to sort of Salt Lake City direction. So that should be fun. So have we woken up to this incredible view from our hotel room in, uh, in Reno? Um, we arrived in in the dark last night, having just driven through uh, some unexpected snowy cap mountain ranges. And um, yeah, we've just, we arrived in Torino in the dark um, and then have opened our curtains this morning and this is what we see. Um, so it's, it's just great. We're packing up now. Everything's pretty ready. Uh, Toby, you ready? Yeah. And we are going to hit the road. Check this out. Uh, the ground is like desert and then, so it looks like it's all year. And then you look in the background and it's actually mountains. Covered in snow. Firstly, tell us where we are. I have no idea where we are. We're somewhere sort of in the mountains on the way to Salt Lake City. In the Sierra Nevada. In the Sierra Nevada. Uh, yeah, so we've just been driving down the highway. I thought we were going to get pulled over by some cops, uh, but it was a car in front, so that was lucky. Uh, he was going about 10, 15 miles an hour faster than me. I was cruising at a cool 82. I think he was, must have been doing 90, 95, something like that. Um, but for a minute I thought the cops were going to pull us over. Luckily it was the car behind. So pleased about that. Um, we're just going to stop for a bit of lunch and I think Pippa's going to take over some driving for this afternoon. Yeah, we've been going for about four hours so far. Yeah. Out of an eight hour day. Well, eight hours worth of driving. So we'll see. Yeah, we'll let's crack get on, let's crack on. We're being a bit bold aren't we today Toes? We haven't booked anywhere to stay yet. We haven't, we're going to just wing it. Figure out where happens. we get to. It's all part of the adventure. Yeah, that's right. Wonderful, wonderful landscapes. Um, we're 
which I have been sleeping through for the last two hours. Um, and Tobes has been doing all of the driving like a legend. That's me. How's it going, Tobes? It's good. Uh, it's pretty mundane. It's uh, 75 miles an hour speed limit, two lanes, not much traffic. Uh, it's a pretty stunning scenery with the mountains in the background. Uh, but I've got the cruise control on. Getting very into the podcasts that I've been listening to called Serial and just sort of fixated on that and just uh, keep an eye on the road and just having a relax. It's pretty nice. Enjoy yourself. Nice. We've got another 330 miles, hour, 30 miles to go, which is about five hours more driving. Yeah. It is absolutely mind blowing. Snow capped mountains, driving across Great Plains. It's just so beautiful. So pleased we're doing this. It's fun, isn't it? Oh, We've just taken a short stop in the Utah Salt Flats. The the space is just so expansive. It's a kind of big basin surrounded by mountains on all sides, um, and we've seen these beautiful flat pools reflecting the clouds, reflecting the mountains. It's gorgeous. We are just outside Salt Lake City. Um, this was supposed to be our final stop for today, um, but we've actually arrived in really good time, so we're gonna press on a bit and uh, see where we can get to. What's that then, Pip? Um, we fa we're driving through a snowstorm. Um, this is so unexpected. It's, uh, we're about half an hour from where we plan to stop for the evening. Um, and we, the weather on, by Salt Lake City was really, really lovely. Very kind of clear, crisp, cold, yes, but the skies were very clear. And we've just passed through a mountain range. And on the other side, it is sleeting snow like this. And it's all starting to settle. Uh, yeah. Fortunately, we have a full tank of petrol. Um, plenty of food, not really much water, but at least we can, you know, go outside and open our mouths to have snow should we be forced to stop. 